Hook, did I ever tell you about the last time I met your father? As I recalled, it was on Mapuzo. I had just used an innocent civilian as a human shield before I encountered your father, I mean, Darth Vader. He entered the village, his helmet freshly shined with voodoo hide, and began murdering various bystanders. I fled the scene, of course, but he pursued me across a mining quarry. After choking me out, he lit a fire with his lightsaber, an elegant weapon for a more civilized age, then used the force to drag me through the flames. By the way, Luke, the force is an energy field used to choke your enemies or throw them across the room. So there I lie in the inferno until your father used the force to put out the flames. Fortunately, for plot reasons, I was not horribly burnt and disfigured. Though he had been intent on pursuing me earlier, and even told his stormtroopers to bring me to him, when the fire started again, he didn't walk through it or around it, nor did he just extinguish the flames as he had done only a moment before. As such, a load of droid carried me to safety while he watched. Very strange man, your father. I mean, Darth Vader. General Kenobi, years ago you served my father in the Clone Wars. Though no, she's only now pretending she doesn't remember me rescuing her nine years ago. It's a little game we play. The event was quite noteworthy and you can even find it chronicled on Disney+, Plus, available now for only $8 a month. You can also read about it on Wikipedia. Which reminds me, I have something here for you. Your father wanted you to have it when you were old enough, or at least I imagine he would have if he knew you existed. I never told him you were born, you see. Quite humorous. What is it? Your father's lightsaber. I plucked it from his smoldering body before he burst into flame. It's a little joke we have, torturing each other over the years. He was but a learner, and it was the last time I ever saw him. Aside from nine years ago, of course. I do hope I see him again. I've been concocting a proper ribbon for him when I see him next. You see, he was upset he was never made a Jedi Master, so I intend to tell him, You're only a master of evil, Darth. Quite the burn, Luke. Though not as bad a burn as when I cut off his arm and legs and left him to catch fire on the volcanic planet Mustafar, of course. He was a real piece of shit, your father. And he was a good friend.